thanks for clicking on my video. Today you join me on a 24 hour session down at Pittsford Fisheries, Northamptonshire. Hello, little update for you. Not a lot's gone on, unfortunately. DJ had a few bleeps earlier on. I had one. Probably just liners, more than likely. Um, rods are still on the spots. I'll show you my rigs at some point when I reel in, stick some fresh bait on. Bloke across the way had a run earlier on, but unfortunately he was getting something from his car and he was running like an Olympian trying to get to his cut, his rods. But uh, yeah, I think he went into the massive lily pad that's across from him and he uh, lost it. So yeah, until I uh, get something or I'll show you my rigs, I'll see you soon. do a recast and I thought I'd take the opportunity to show you my rig. So I've got two 16mm RFM boilies with uh, a cordar size 8 curved shank hook and a bit of shink shrink tubing just to, to give it that really aggressive angle and then about six inches of ESP tungsten uh, coated braid little anti-tangle sleeve for, as a, for the kicker and then a three ounce flat pair inline lead that I've taken the insert out and put an anti-tangle sleeve inside so it acts as a running lead and then about a foot foot and a half of tubing I've got that on both rods so uh, let's hope it does the business and I get it back out see you soon well it's not the biggest but it's a lovely one. Nine pound on the nose, lovely ghosty. First one of the session oh. is now for about six, half six in the evening. Oh, it's all, it's all, all good, there. lovely jubbly. We'll uh, 
get this one back in the water and I'll see you soon. Tight lines I'm, everyone. I'm, I'm He's a knobhead, isn't he? <laughs> this is what I've got to put up with all night. A complete beep. Knobhead. Well, hey, peeps. It's now a quarter to nine at night. I've just uh, redone my rods, put some more bait out. Um, hopefully, can get a bite in the night, which will be sweet. But I think I got me all my tasks done just in a timely fashion, because it's just started raining. So I'm in my bivvy in a minute, just with the door open, having a look out. Hopefully, I can bag one. If I can, see you soon. peeps little update for you had two fish in the night uh, one at about half 11 and that was 13 and a half pound and then I had one at about half one and that was 14 pound uh, didn't get any more after that but it's now oh, about eight o'clock in the morning and uh, we've just had some bacon butties Donny Lee's caught Oh, about ten little fish this morning. He's done a good little fish. Oh, you had ten. Oh, okay, he's had ten. <laughs> We've had a good morning. DJ had one at about half twelve last night, but then it came off. It snapped his hook link, so yeah, it felt decent. He said, so yeah, unfortunately he lost it, but. That's why it's called fishing and not catching, I suppose. <coughs> Rods are still out. Uh, I'm going to start doing a slow pack up now. Getting ready to go home because I've got stuff to do today. So, uh, until then, see you soon. It's now the Sunday after my 24 hour session at the weekend. Yeah, so I ended up with three. Uh, DJ lost one, and Donnie Lee had about 20 small fish which I'll uh, stick a few picks up at the end of this. Um, so all in all, it was a good return trip to Pittsburgh Fishery. Really nice lake, really well looked after. Really well run by a lady called Jan. Um, yeah, it's not too dear. It's, it's only 25 quid for 24 hours, which I think is pretty reasonable. Such a nice fishery. Uh, got a loo on site, you know, it's nice, well looked after. Um, next session probably be the end of August. August? Yeah, August. Probably be the end of August. Um, not quite sure where yet. I'm um, hoping to get uh, a tench fishing session in at some point this year. I really want to go after some tench. Um, yeah, so please hit like if you did. Subscribe, stroke like my Facebook page, depending on where you're watching. If you haven't already. Until then, all the best and tight lines.